Well, Paul, from uh, first whistle to, to last, it's what it's all about, entertainment. It was an entertaining game. It was a good game. You know, I think Hartley Poole, we said in the, 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 the uh, pre-press conference, the pre-match uh, conference, how bright Hartley Poole are. They're a they're really bright young team. They've got a lot of energy in the team. They cause every team they play problems. You know, they equalise late on at Coventry and Coventry are carrying all before them at times in League One. You know, and I watched that game and it would be a difficult game today. And One of the things about playing with two lads up front, sometimes you negate the middle of the pitch. And when you play against teams who can handle the ball and move it, it becomes a problem. Certainly, we, 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 we accepted this at half time and we were always liable that we thought our front two could hurt them more than we were in the second half. Unfortunately for us, when we can see the goal like that, and it's a poor goal. It's a really poor goal because it's not good football, it's just people switching off. And that's the game. You know, but we've, had a, we've had a good uh, pre Christmas. We've come in today, we took a point, albeit we're all disappointed, we know that. But one thing we're all learning, you know, you look around some of the other results today. It's a tough league, it's an unforgiving league, and you must just stay focused on what you do. I think great credit must go to Hartlepool, because I think they'll cause a lot of teams problems between now and the end of the season.